everyone so I'm just gonna kind of ramble today um I guess it's gonna be like my what I've been doing this month or favorites of the month I guess so I've been doing a lot of swapping and hauls and I have another haul video I just put one up but I'm gonna put the second one up because I put I did two like in one week and um yeah so, so far, my favorites that I've gotten in the last few swaps and hauls have been the Joy de Vivre uh, Cream Blend Blush. Let me show you what it looks like on my finger. Ooh, that's a huge swatch. Oops. That's what it looks like. It's a really pretty corally pink. It's just my color. My lighting is kind of off right now. It's right there. Um, and this is what it looks like on the back of my hand. Blend it in a little bit right there. It's just really pretty and adds like a nice color to my cheeks. Let me wipe this off. Um, I'm also loving this uh, Gold Deposit Mineralized Skin Finish. It's brand new, basically. I think the girl only used it like one time, but I sanitize it still anyway. And it's a really nice gold mineralized skin finish. That's what it looks like. And there's a swatch right there. And it just gives me like a really nice glow like right there. I do it very, very lightly. Like some people like a really bronze look, but I don't like to look have too much bronzer. It just depends on what mood I'm in. Um Oh, I have an idea. Maybe I'll do a video on my favorite bronzing and blushing products. I'm gonna do that next. So you could probably see like three videos in a row, but sounds like fun because I have nothing to do right now. I just got out of my English class. Didn't really feel like putting on too much makeup. I just put on some um, foundation and eyeliner and mascara. I don't know if you can see my eyelashes. Let me see. I've never done this before. Oh, there we go. See them? They're short, but they're cute and I love them. Um, why smile? <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm kind of bored. Um... I also really like this Estee Lauder Tender Blush. I showed it in my last video. It's like my favorite. It's so pretty. I'm so glad I bought it. That's what it looks like. Hold on. I always keep plastic and stuff. That's what it looks like. It's a really nice light pink. Ah, dropped it. Okay, got it. It's a really nice light pink. Pink, like a peach color. There we go. It's like a peach, a light peach, and it fades into a really nice um, plum. So I got that. That I really like. That's my favorite. Um, oh, I like the Dame Blush, MAC Dame Blush that I got. Oh, and today I just got Feeling in the mail from MAC. But this is Dame. And I like to keep things in the boxes. This is Dame. That's what it looks like. MAC. Dame. And then I just got feeling in the mail today, so I'm going to try this out uh, when I go to work tonight. That's what it looks like. So, Dame and Feet. They look the same when I do that. Let's see. Let's tilt them like. There we go. See, you can see they're different. This one's Dame right here, and this is Feeling. And Dame is a satin, and Feeling is a beauty powder blush. But they're both really pretty and I like them. I've been using Dame every day since I got it, so that and the Joy de Verve Cream Blend Blush and the bronzer. Like this week I've just been trying a lot of stuff and it's really nice. And um oh I put the three eyeshadows that I got from the swap into my MAC 15 palette. I moved some of them around so now all my palettes are full. And they are right here. This I don't know if you can see the color. There we go. This one's brulee. This is nylon, and this is a uh, down brown. It's like a really chocolate brown. Huh. Maybe if I just turn it regular, you can see that. Oh, this one is in bark. I use this for my eyebrows because um, I like to use powder. Um, but what I do is I take this Sonia Kashuk brush right here. It's just um small brush from Sony Cash at Target and then I spritz it with some Fix Plus or 
um, Mist and Fix from Makeup Forever, and then I put it into right here, and I just press it in, and then I draw my eyebrows. Well, fill in my eyebrows because my eyebrows aren't like shaved off or anything; it's like actual hair. But um, that's what I do for my eyebrows. So on my blog, I'm going to put all of my show pictures of my three Mac palettes, and then um, do a blush overview and a bronzer. And, but I'm also going to do videos, so it just depends on what you like. Or if you want to see pictures, you can go to my blog. I need to keep updating that because, like, kind of lagging. Sorry if you can hear, like, the cars and stuff. I'm, like, in front. My camera's, like, in front of my window, and then there's my closet. And you can see my lamp. I love that lamp. Um, oh, and I really like this lip liner that I got in Swap. It's stripped down. It's just like a nice neutral brown, light brown, kind of medium brown. Pretty sure I could, uh, I don't know, this kind of reminds me of like an eyebrow pencil color for someone who's lighter skinned. But, what are you eating, Sophia? One second. Puppy's getting a hold of stuff. But, um, yeah, I'm just kind of bored and rambling. Oh, I used the, um, F80 today with my foundation. I think it soaks up more product than the other one, but it blends a lot better. I think it's because it's like, it covers more area and it's quicker application than using the F82. But I have both now. And then I'm going to get the F84 and use it for blush and see how I like that. And then if I really like it, I'm going to put it into my um, kit. And then I have all three three brushes brand new on my kit because it's only $42 so you save like $8 if you buy all three of them at the same time from Sigma. I, I really like Sigma brushes. I have a lot of them. I have this one which is the F20 and I use this for bronzer like just to go right here because it actually makes a really nice like a point see, like this when it after I wash it and it's just like it's just fluffy on the outside but it still has that like chisel part so I usually put it here and across the top of my cheeks or I'll use my MAC 165 which is a little egg brush little egg brush um, I also have a Sigma SS 187 this is when they still had the numbers that replicated MAC um, those are my face brushes from them I have a Sigma um, E45, which is like the MAC 226. I have a, let me see, I have a Sigma version of the MAC 227. I used to have the MAC version, but I swapped it for something else. And the Sigma one is exactly identical to the MAC one. Like, no joke, exactly the same chisel right here and everything like pointy. And that's the large fluff. There we go. Um, what else do I have from them? I have this E35, it's supposed to be like the MAC 222, but it, it's more like a MAC 224 with white bristles. I have a Sigma um, E20, which is just the short shader. Uh, and Oh, and then I, I got the little tiny blending brush. I think there was one more, but I totally am blanking out and can't remember. But, um... Yeah, those are those brushes. I also have the CPC version of the MAC 222. I like this one more because it's like more precise, like in my crease. I really like this one. And then I have the chisel brush from, C from uh, I mean Coastal Sense, not CPC, sorry. Coastal Sense. And I have a pencil brush from that. And then I have this brush, which is the Pro Blending Fluff Brush, which is basically identical to the MAC. I get these two mixed up all the time. No joke. Um, and I have some more brushes, but I have my brush haul on my blog, so I'll link my blog in the bottom bar, and I'm going to do some more videos, because I need something to do. Um, stay healthy and beautiful. Talk to you guys later. Bye.